Hello and welcome back to My Cart Girl Life, where we take things off the cart as well. I'm Cass and today I have a little special someone with me. Ridiculous Nicholas! <laughs> let's not let so, that catch on. Let's not let that catch on. Hey, if the shoe fits. Alright, so as you can see, we have my new merch on. Give us a spin. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Official golf cart driver. Now, you know what that means next time I'm at the course, right? What? Official cart driver. What does it mean? That means I'm getting behind the wheel. <laughs> Only when we're playing, not when we're selling drinks. Uh, and as you can see, every hardworking cart girl needs an all in the day's work sweatshirt. And I want to show you the rest of everything that I have. Nicholas, my humble assistant, would you mind bringing us the box of happiness? Thank you. Did I mention I got four hours of sleep last night? On the counter, by the coffee maker? Oh, yeah. Where else do you keep a coffee mug for crying out loud? This well, guy. In your place, pretty much anyway. That one hurt a little. <laughs> oh my gosh! Look, we're gonna have some coffee in this this morning. All right, guys, so here we have the Shots First Math Later mug. Oh my gosh, this is like literally my favorite mug I've ever seen. You know that feeling when you're passing out shots to the golfer and you're trying to add up all of them in your head? Yeah, I like to say, shots first, math later. Party first, figure out the details later. Yeah, yeah, said from a golfer himself. <laughs> oh, what's next? <laughs> Look how stinking cute. Oh my gosh. Mm, it still smells good. I wore it yesterday. I smell so good. And you will too once you get one of these sweatshirts. I'm just kidding. I'm not responsible for your body odor. But honestly, how freaking cute is this? I love it so much. Cart girls everywhere will be wearing this on the course. <laughs> Can't wait to see oh, it. It looks a little bit more up my alley. Oh yeah? It, it kind of reminds me of my college days. Aww. <laughs> yeah, if you're not so much a pink girl, you're going for more of the neutral tones. We got this for ya. I'm really into this color lately and I have some sweatpants and leggings that will go perfect with this. All right, and if you really hate colors, there's one for you. <laughs> Don't say that. I like that one. No, so this one is actually more of like a t-shirt material. It's not a sweatshirt, but I wanted this because sometimes it's a little hot. I love this. If this was a real school, and hey, maybe it will be one day, this would be so cute. And it's a little... Little cats. You know, the cats had access to this before everyone else. Hey, if the cats love it, then we love it. <laughs> so you just want a little t-shirt? There you, you go. Yeah, me. His and hers. <laughs> Aww. So I'd be wearing this one at the gym, to bed, just hanging out. And when you get off work, you just put that right on. All yeah. in a day's work. Because you know that we be hustling. I'm just at work all day dreaming about what I could put on my Cass Holland t-shirt when I get home. <laughs> yes, that's what we'd like to hear. I also have a matching hat too, but Nicholas wanted to wear it. So he like left it in his golf bag. Um, So we don't have that right now. We're supposed to tell them that. <laughs> but here's a pick. Is it there? Not yet. <sighs> okay. <laughs> So as you can see, I'm so excited for you guys to have this merch, feel it, touch it, wear it, tag me in everything. It really is a dream come true. I freaking dreamed about this beautiful clothing line. And it's only just the beginning. So if you like it, let me know. You better buy them quick, because they're going to be gone quick. <laughs> I might buy them all. Anybody that drives a freaking golf cart and people that don't drive a golf cart, it's literally for everyone. It's so dang stinking cute. Anyway, I had a morning of my own this morning because like I said, um, we went to bed at about, what, like 2 or 3 a.m.? 2. Okay, that's not that bad. I got up at like 6.30ish to run some errands. Let's switch back to that. And then it will see what I did earlier. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, sorry, this is me before being alive. <laughs> So it's about 7.30 a.m. and I am heading to Dunkin' Donuts currently. We're a little off schedule today, but that's okay. I had to make some adjustments. As you can see, the brain is not working before the coffee. <laughs> uh, so I was up last night until like 2 a.m. Finishing a lot of the cards and Nick is in town. So lately we've been trying to rack up like the rewards cards from the casinos. 
I wish we started using them a long time ago. But anyway, we were trying to see like the quickest way to get to the next tier. Like after time, if you like rack your points up, you can get free rooms and stuff. Also like outside of Vegas, the Resorts World one, we've been wanting to go to Bimini, like in the Bahamas and they have a Resorts World there. So we're like, let's try to rack those points up. I guess like doing the slots can really increase your points. So we were also in the background watching like slot videos like to see which ones have the best odds like just the overall best chances you'd have at slot machines where to go which casinos like for mgm caesar resorts for just all of them <laughs> so the original plan was to get up extra early this morning so that we could get on the golf course you know before all the golfers get out there so that we could film tiktoks and some videos with the reindeer inflatable costume. Tom, the owner, <laughs> went ahead and got these inflatable Christmas costumes. They've been so cute. So far we did the gingerbread man. If you haven't seen my TikTok, go to my TikTok, Cass Holland, and watch the gingerbread house video. <laughs> and the gingerbread costume at the end of the video. It's freaking hilarious. You have to see it. I was like crying, laughing. It was so funny. But there's a reindeer one as well. So we were gonna try to get out there like on the course before the golfers were out there so we wouldn't be in the way but i'm like you know we're already too late as it's already 7 30 so let's get to bed early tonight and just do it tomorrow so i told him to sleep in because if he's gonna be tired all day he'll be of no use to me <laughs> and like i said i'm going to dunkin Donuts because not only do i need my freaking coffee if you don't know the maintenance guys play a very important role in the golf course and in the golf community all over they're also out there trying to work on their golf game and they're always buying stuff for me and tipping me really well so i wanted to give back to them well, it's not as much as i would like to do but i'm also going to be getting them all gift cards i think there's 15 of them um, i'm gonna get 15 10 dollar dunkin donuts gift cards because i know Maybe like in their coffee, their donuts, their breakfast sandwiches. So I think $10 can get them a coffee and a sweet treat. I was originally gonna do like Home Depot gift cards, but I'm like, that's not gonna go a very long way at Home Depot. $10, even $20 can't really get too much there. But we are pulling up to Dunkin' now. Oh yeah, no line. Can I get 15 gift cards through the window? Either way, I'm getting a coffee. Good morning, what can we get started for you? Morning, can I get a large French vanilla hot coffee? Two cream and two sugar? Anything Can I get gift cards through you? Yes, we can, with the window. Thank you. No problem. Clear up some of these drink holders. There you go. Yes. Thank you so no much. Have a good one. Thank you. Oh my gosh. 15 of them. Oh my gosh. So. Not gonna lie, I'm a little, <clears throat> what the hell? So I asked her if I could use my app to pay for like the gift cards and coffee and everything. And she was like, yeah, yeah, you can. She asked the other girl, yeah, you can. So I load a hundred dollars onto my app, go to pay, I hand her the app. And then we find out that you can't use the app to pay for the gift cards. <laughs> so I used my card to pay the 150. So now I have a hundred dollars on my Dunkin Donuts app that I can't get back. So I'm gonna have to eventually spend $100 at Dunkin Donuts, yep, yep. I mean, honestly, that shouldn't be a problem. It might just take me a year. <laughs> this bus just knocked a cone in the middle of the road. And it's right in my path. Okay, we're heading to CVS. I have to focus on driving. All right, so we just pulled up to CVS. I need duct tape, more Christmas cards. We'll see what they have. Maybe they'll have something cute. Oh, I'm gonna print some pictures. Okay, let's go to CVS. Um, <laughs> that's cute. Okay, looks like they have some cute cards. I kinda like these. Or this one. Hmm, this one you get options. This one is just these. All right, we'll do this one. Now just some duct tape. And there we go. $10. Ooh, hi Barbie. Okay, let's try this. I think we're getting somewhere. Yay! All right, what's next? All right, I got them all cropped. I think I'm just gonna check out. Okay, I got everything I need, I hope. Uh, I'm gonna head back to the house, finish up some more cards, get all of this stuff together, and go run and jump on the bed and wake up Nicholas. <laughs> Let me explain what 
we are doing today. Well, what we're going to attempt to do today. We were gonna do this uh, either tomorrow or the next day, but now that our schedule has kind of moved around a little due to today not really working out the way we planned, I think today would be the perfect day to go check out the new Casino Fountain Blue. Like, it's so crazy. When I first moved to this trip, so, Across the street from Fountain Blue is this high rises called Sky. And I looked there before I looked where I live now. And I remember looking at one unit and it was on the strip side. So it looked directly at this dead, vacant eyesore of a place. <laughs> and it was Fountain Blue. So they started trying to build it, I think like 10 years ago or something and lost funding, couldn't build it. A couple years ago, they decided to start it back up and it just opened last week. It said it was open to the public now, but I feel like it's not because why haven't I been seeing people post there? Like on Instagram, like I don't see people like tagging them. I don't see them in the new bars and restaurants there. The club is open because somebody invited me to the club. It's called Live. So I'm super confused about that, but we are gonna go check it out. I'm so excited. I mean, I hope, I hope. We've been really just indulging and loving different spas. And Resorts World is my favorite. I feel like I'm gonna like this one as much as I like Resorts World. I've been going to the spas because it's just been so nice to have like a few hours in the day where you just like put your phone down, you completely relax. We've been doing that like once a week. <laughs> doing like the saunas, the cold plunges. I've just been loving that like for my mental health. It's been great self-care days. We're gonna see if they have any availability at the spa or if we can get like a tour or kind of see what they have. I heard it's amazing, like the best spa on the strip and it's co-ed, which is so awesome because right now Resorts World is like the only one that's co-ed. So we're looking for like more. So now there's another one. So we can go back and forth between the two. And I heard this one has like snow falling from the sky and I think they have a salon there I kind of want to see <laughs> if they can give me like I don't know I think I want to do something different with my hair I can't choose between like just full bleach like completely blonde and like cut it or if I want to do when you just have like these two pieces that are lighter than the rest of your hair I want to like bleach the two front sections and like leave everything else so maybe somebody can like quickly bleach me <laughs> I don't know and it's like, do they even have people working there yet? Like it literally just opened. We'll see what they have. We'll see what we are able to do today. But either way, we're gonna try to check it all out. So I'm almost home and then I'm gonna go run, jump on the bed and wake up Nicholas. Um, what were we saying? All right, we are back. No, we're not back. We're, we're already, we just zoomed back. You are to, back. I'm back. To us now. <laughs> we went away to watch earlier. And now you're back. All right, you're back. <laughs> and we're back at you. We're back. We're, we're gonna go. We're gonna go to Fountain Blue now. Let's go. Yeah, what'd she say? <laughs> we're looking so fine in my car, girl line. Ooh, 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 uh, uh, hey. EP coming soon. Okay, so we're driving to Fountain Blue and guess what? Nicholas called and made us some reservations. Our reservation is in an hour and a half. So excited. This has been an empty freaking piece of trash on the strip for so long. I gotta see what this is, don't you? Oh. Ah. 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 <laughs> I'm gonna insert that little clip. Ah. <laughs> we're getting a rewards card. I told them earlier how it, that was like our new thing. You'd be surprised how quickly the benefits actually start paying off. Went to Sahara yesterday, had 150 in free play and a $50 food voucher just on my account. So I got to play for free. We haven't even been there in like months. Yeah. That just all like racked up. We didn't do shit. I'm so excited. Mm -hmm. We're going to figure out the parking situation and then we'll see you inside. Well, hopefully. What if we can't get in? We'll get in. Miami style. Ooh, 
I like that, that's cool. Oh, very Alice in Wonderland. There's a little lounge, cool. Nick said this way to the slats. <laughs> oh my gosh, so if you can see, the chandelier is their little logos. So I do have a question. When a casino opens, if the odds are better or worse or anything? Um, there is never a time where a casino will increase the odds or just the odds. They get it as it comes from the manufacturer. They don't gotta make their so money back? They, they always make their money back. They don't ever adjust them for the holidays, specific times of day, when something opens, if there's a convention in town. They never do that, so myth busted. Gamble responsible. Even the rugs have the little bow tie logo. Seriously, the detail in this place. And Nick's all excited that the Gucci store is coming. <laughs> I'm gonna move to Vegas and work there and model for them. <laughs> Looks pretty good with that logo. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so sick. Looks like over here they have blue bar. Oh my gosh. Nick is on a hunt for the rewards, does he wants to print out his card before we do anything. Trying to get points off of our reservation, obviously. <laughs> I have to say, this hoodie just looks amazing. That's why I'm following far behind him, so I can just stare at it. <laughs> well, Nick is gonna wait in line. I'm gonna walk around and see what's in here. Okay, uh, see you in a little bit. Okay, that looks like a nice restaurant. Vida Vida. Pretty in there too. Here is a little cafe. Oh, I see macaron. When Nick called for the spa, he asked the lady what the best restaurant was, and she said that was the only one she ate at, I think. What is that? Whoa. <laughs> so it's beautiful. Is that an egg? I love hard boiled eggs. I love how they're all about the bow ties on everything. Looks like they're still getting a lot of the decorating going on. I know they just opened up, so that's probably why they're still working on a lot of things, but I think this is gonna be a really good casino. I really wanna know what this is, if it's another high limit area or if it's a new restaurant. Oh, it's probably a store. Washing potato. Hmm. Here's the high limit area. Just give Nick a little while. He'll get into the high limit slots. Some of the different machines that they have. Ooh, they're gonna be putting in a Cartier. Cartier. It looks like there is a whole upper level up there as well, but we'll wait for Nick to go up there. Let's go check on him. I see my cutie patootie. <laughs> All right, you're getting closer. <laughs> Excuse me, are, are you the official golf cart driver? All right, let's see it, let's see it, yeah! <laughs> there we go, we got our rewards card. Let's do this thing. Right, so, so now that we're all official. The one limitation is in order to win the free play, you can't put progressive slots. So we have to be careful with selecting which ones we want. Okay, good to know. You know what we should do? Get our first fountain blue snack. Oh, wow. That sounds good. What? Getting so hungry. <laughs> Getting a quick bite before the spa because we don't know what kind of snacks they'll have there, if any. I didn't get any Ooh. Yeah, I want to be trying some of these juices. <gasps> Is that a brookie? Oh, holy cow! That thing looks like <laughs> insane. Brookie, brookie. Look at the chocolate croissant. Look at that carrot <laughs> Is that a brookie? Like a. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is. We gotta take this all in. Aww. S'mores cappuccino cup, that sounds like something you like. This is like a uh, Oh, they have crepes. All right, so here's what we got. Trying out the cafe that the spa receptionist recommended. What is that? This is a pastrami sandwich. Marble dry bread. <laughs> Look at that. You Is that good? I got me a little Greek salad. I'm trying to be healthy, but we did also grab two rose macaroons. You got to. Yeah. It was either that or a brookie, brookie that was about six inches in diameter, diameter and, but an inch thick. So we might come back to that later though. 
We made the healthy. We got it. We'll spread it out in the spa. Spa. Maybe. The girl that makes the crepes is also giving me. Um, was letting me know about the crepes, and those sound good too. They have sweet and savory. So, but as long as they have Nutella, I'm all good. What did they have as savory? Um, they like some kind of like the ham and cheese one, mm. and like some type of like prosciutto. And she recommended dipping them in the tomato soup. You like the cucumbers? Kinda. They're pretty good. Cassie is on the Mediterranean diet. Are you? Yeah. Hint, hint. Santorini vacation. <clears throat> hint, hint. If you've been with us in the past, you know that we're connoisseurs when it comes to macarons. <laughs> and we've done quite a number of reviews. This is a rose macaroon. The best flavor. You're gonna get my live reaction to eating right now. Soft, tastes fresh. The rose is not overpowering. Some others have been. Not too dry either. Yeah, it's a pretty good one. This is. I don't want to be too generous, but like 9.5 out of 10. Whoa! I can't say 10 out of 10. Excuse me, who was the macaroon chef back here? Think makes the macaroons in the morning. Or do you think it's like a like a group thing? It's an overnight chef. Well, the Greek salad was good. I would get it again. Let's see if the macaroon is really as good as Nick says. Oh, are you kidding me? It's so good. What do it taste like? An animal cracker. I didn't get that. <clears throat> it's all good. Okay, had our little bite to eat. Bon Bon Cafe was good. Now we are going to head up to the spa. I get so, I get so excited in like new, New places, new casinos. That's yeah, that's that's I'm really excited because for a while we were going to this one spa because we Resorts really, World, yeah. yeah. I explained all that. I was not about to just openly talk shit on them and say they're no longer the best. I was not gonna say which one. We don't know yet. Right, but from from Wait. the amenities and the offerings, they're no longer the best. That's why I was going around with this thing. We'll be the judge of that in just a few minutes. What I was saying is it's nice to be like to go between the two. <sighs> I'm so excited. You know what I like best about spas is that it's something that we found that we enjoy in common. It's like a good bonding time for us, don't you think? Here's another restaurant. I wonder if this one's open yet. Up we go. Oh yeah, we gotta try that one. Oh, I like it. I love the color scheme in here. It reminds me of the ocean. Yeah, to the spa. They're not ready. That's pretty. Uh, I'm gonna go there. What's that? Cute. It is cute. Good, how are you? Pretty! <gasps> the spa! Let's see what the situation back here is.
cold fundies. I did pretty good. Nick is really good at coaching them since he does it for work. So he got me through it. We did it for like six minutes. <laughs> So we can really soak in the minerals. Yeah. Or what about like the jacuzzi? Yeah, I'm just go back to the jacuzzi. And they have a snow room here. It snows from the ceiling, but it builds up into a pile because it's just falling in one place. <laughs> so they'll probably have to figure that out. They like, went in there and kicked the snow around. It was really cold on the head. But other than that, Loving this spot and the show. So good. He's so cute. Gonna go in the jacuzzi. See ya. <sighs> wow. Rejuvenation nation. Yeah. <laughs> I feel amazing. <laughs> What's your favorite part of that or your favorite thing? Um. I have to say going into the cold plunge with Nick was probably my favorite part. Aww, yeah. That. Oh, that's cool. Soon. You should work here. <laughs> Whoa. Nice little gym. Wow. That's nice. It's already dark out. All right, we got more shops this way. We're currently looking for dinner. So there might be a little food court this way. So. Yeah, everything sounds good. We found more fake cookies. They call them bronchies, not brookies. They have a little sports bar over here and in the back is the sports book. Did we already walk by this? This is pretty, gold club. Ooh. Dang it, well the place we wanted to go from earlier looks closed. Does that mean we're going to the mother wolf place? I actually wanted to go there more. So cute. Look, babe. Yeah. I ate starting off strong with some focaccia bread. Oh, wow. That's really nice. Oh, I don't want to eat it. It took five years for them to perfect it. Let's see how it tastes. Right now. Thank you so much. That's what you ordered? The pizza you wanted? No, it's so good. Now we'll have a nip do a little taste test. Oh, thank you, baby. I want you to have a taste test. Let me just break the table real quick. It's so cheesy. Yum. That is so very good. Oh, it's good. Well, we gotta face ourselves. We still have bottles. We haven't been eating as much lately, so our stomachs are smaller now. A month ago, I could have cleared this. And finally, we have the pasta, cacio e pepe, and rigatoni. Better than Esther's. Better than Esther's. Better than Esther's. It's very al dente though. And last but not least, we got some gelato. Hazelnut and chocolate. Dig in, babe. Yummy!
Our total is 128. That's crazy because that was my locker number at the, in the spa. 128 is the house of where I grew up. Wow. That's weird. On that note, I think it's time to hit the slots. Mother Wolf was so freaking delicious, like amazing, authentic Italian. Jinx, you owe me a Red Bull. No, I said it first. The bathrooms are so pretty. Not sure what's going on over there. We have found the slot machines. We are about to hit up the slots. Are you so excited? Yep, we just gotta find the right machine. Gotta test our luck in this casino. Thank you so much for watching. What's your conclusion? We're gonna be in here for a long time just to try everything we wanna try. Yeah. We might have a new favorite spot. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, comment, share. I already said comment. I always say comment. Hit the notification bell. Do all the things you're supposed to do and we keep doing that. <laughs> oh, it's good. All right. See ya. Bye.